perfect sense of style, with a deep reverence for a site's history and surrounding environment. With an abiding interest in the intimacy of space, the Coco has a personal preference for designing, restoring, and transforming residential structures. His growing list of high-profile clients includes former President Bill Clinton and Senator Hillary Rodham. So let's take a look. I don't think there's any project I design without the use of music. Uh, music connects me with architecture, and I consider music to be fluid architecture. My name is Don Lococo. Uh, I'm the principal at Don Lococo Architects. Music allows me to connect with architecture uh, the same way I think that color does. It's an aspect of tones. It's an aspect of contrasts. And I think when I sit down and play, I actually can feel the color. Residential architecture is different from other types of architecture because we deal one-on-one -on -one with clients in what they consider to be their castle. Uh, it creates a different level of investment from an architectural point of view and a different level of intimacy uh, in which your relationship with them and their house. You're not talking about a building that uh, is an office or something that they walk by. It's something that they're in every day. And so when it begins to go up around them, there's a thrill and you witness uh, their excitement as that building unfolds. As the house moves from a drywall stage and you're dealing with wood trim and the stone of a floor, and then when it begins to get colored, that's when the momentum of the house really becomes something interesting. Sometimes colors are loose and sometimes they strike a pose with each other and they're somewhat staged. I think both tell you a lot about a client and uh, their attitudes towards color. So we put together a portfolio of our work and began to discuss the ideas of architecture and color. And that's when we began to really realize how they're intertwined and how we use color to connect the architecture with the observer. It was an honor to receive the Benjamin Moore Hugh Award and to be in the company of such recognized and distinguished designers. Thank you.